idea of taking a person that have no feelings, no emotions, and then put him on a journey that he acquire all those emotions and feelings from somebody else. That was the highest concept in the script that really attracted me. That journey of, of a character within such a massive, um, high stakes plot. They stuck Billy in my head. I got a scar, see? All the stuff that he knew, all the stuff that he could do, I got it all scrambled up inside me. It's impressive. It had a level of being touching, although it was a on the surface a violent movie. Um, but those elements kind of bled out. And um, I'm always attracted to things when they are multi-layered. Yeah, this is an action movie, and Ariel is, you know, going to direct that. But he also responded very much to this, the confusion that my character is brought into the movie with. When the idea of Kevin came in, I thought he's actually going to be a perfect Jericho because here we can take somebody that we so used to see him in, on the charming and on the uh, lovable side, and let's break all of that and then reintroduce that charm again. It was fun working with, with, with Ariel in the room and shaping it because Ariel is so keyed into the characters and into secondary and tertiary characters and making sure that each of them has a voice and an arc and also becomes Dimension. becomes castable, um, which is which is very important because he has brought together a really fabulous cast on this. Ariel is a shooter. We have big deals here with seven and eight cameras rolling at the same time, but also he can get into a small house and, and, and you know do the very intimate work that is the heart of the movie. Besides is a good shooter understanding this, the script and uh, the, the, the thing that I like about uh, Ariel is very sensitive. And I like uh, people to portray the emotion of every movie. To me, this is the, the, if you can make the people feel for the character, feel for the movie, uh, you are 50% or more have a successful movie. We've seen it all already in cinema, but what we didn't see is, is, is unique journeys of people. And I think in the end of the day, that wins. And I think having a script with 318 scenes in a very com confined schedule of basically less than 50 days uh, with 56 locations, you, you're starting the day with not knowing where you're gonna go and if you're gonna win or lose. You know, you're trying to serve the genre of the big action thriller. But in the end of the day, I think where the audience is gonna be connected is to a person that feel for the first time. All the decisions we make are important, not only for the ones that will go see it on a big screen, but also the level of detail and nuance that somebody will watch privately and like maybe return to the movie. You know, that's what I always think is a successful movie, is a movie that is one that's willing to be passed on you know, five years from now, 10 years from now, 15 years from now. That's a successful movie. We have a tendency to measure them on their opening weekend, but that's not how I measure them. So my hope is, can this movie travel through time? Will there be an aerial energy that, that becomes a signature that suddenly we begin to see Ariel as he continues to uh, grow as a director, that this film will stand nicely both both in how it was received commercially and in both how he feels about it later on in his career looking back. Washington, Berlin, Beijing will be graveyards. Semari Kuru, terrorist no Kyoi. Sekai no Ume or Nigirunoa. Korosareta, CIA no Kyok. Can you? Can you not transfer memories from a dead mammal to a live one? Your name is Bill. You're an intelligence officer of the CIA. He can find Lucy any time, but he is in way over his head. So the Dutchman calls you Bill Pope. Remember! I don't remember nothing. They're not gonna like him. He feels nothing. No love. Who are you? Your husband in my head. Can you feel what Billy felt? I feel it. He loves you. There's so many lives at stake, they don't matter! No 
whatever they are, I got no use for them. Not much meaning in life without them. Time limit is 48 hours. その記憶は一人の男と世界の運命を変える I got this figured out. クリミナル二人の記憶を持つ男